this is a totally shocking, incredible Duel Immortal card. Um, you know, in a time where there only were two Immortals, uh, this is the card, and it's probably the greatest, earliest Duel Kobe uh, Jordan card, you know, ever made. I mean, this is, this is so good. Uh, the game jersey product, obviously, starting in 97, would become the most important patch, you know, issue ever. Uh, it just kicked off, you know, everything that we care about from the, the, the patch and then what would give way to the patch autograph as well, something they also invented the same year. This in 2000, this is the fourth year of the game jersey, and they, they rolled out a dual immortal. Here we go. And at the time, Kobe, he wasn't the immortal uh, that he became, of course. So uh, it was a bold move to, to put these guys on the same card. History is what transpired. And I mean, just look at the photo depictions that they chose. I mean, if this isn't like the heir apparency trying to be conveyed in a trading card, this is just history. It's a beautiful, it's an on-card auto. The patch windows, you know, mirror to the, the player jerseys beautifully. I and mean, this is a work of art. Whoever put this together really emphasized a lot of the fine details. And again, it's just there's a universe conspiring component to this too, because nobody could have predicted this would become what it became. You know, what it is now is something that might be a once in a lifetime opportunity to acquire something like this. They only made 10 of them. This one's zeroed nine of 10. Uh, it's one of the more exciting uh, early cards that we're depicting in this uh, premier auction. And I encourage investors to take it seriously. You very likely won't, won't be able to find another. Technical grade of an eight overall due to just light corner wear around the periphery. Um, you know, but soup to nuts. It's, it's, it's a card that looks largely pack fresh. There's no major condition issues that really draw your eye. Uh, it's, just, uh, it's just a very special offering. Do a quick scan on the periphery, but you can tell it's just light circulation, a little bit of edge chipping. The autograph received a nine overall. Uh, the overall look and feel of them is quite good. That will show kind of the Jordan auto looks about as good as you could hope for. Kobe's is good too, though there's just a little bit of uh, ink streaking here, and that probably is why it received a nine. Uh, but I mean, it's it's as close to you know ten autos as I think a nine auto could get. There's really no major flaws. This is just a stunning piece. Again, I encourage people to take it seriously. Uh, we've never seen one before. Is the first. What a cool card.